Okay, if you are a filmmaker or an aspiring filmmaker, then you probably know there are about three, four, five, 17 jillion film festivals out there, which is good news and bad news. Good news because it means there's no lack of opportunities to get your masterpiece or work in progress out to the eyes and ears of industry around the globe. Bad news is tons of competition for those same eyes and ears and tons of cash for all the submission fees. So today we're gonna narrow it down to just some of the international festivals that specialize in short films. Although there's no easy way to make a short list of all these film festivals, we're gonna try to do it anyway. So let's do it. Golden Nuggets. Nuggets. Five international short film festivals. Nugget one. The Palm Springs International Short Fest. What you need to know. This sunny resort city of Palm Springs, California hosts the largest festival of short films in North America. It takes place across seven days in the summer, showing more than 350 short films every year. Short Fest takes place around mid-June. Be sure to check their website here and in the show notes for the exact dates and deadlines. Why should I submit though? Prestige, exposure, and opportunity. Since it started, PSISF has hosted over 100 short films that went on to secure Oscar nominations in the short film categories. That's about five per year. Finally, each year over two thirds of the films presented at the festival are acquired by distributors, networks, online companies, or fine sales agents. Nugget two. One of the world's premier international short film festivals is located in France and it's called Le Clermont Ferrand International Short Film Festival. Le Clermont Ferrand International Short Film Festival. I don't know if I pronounce it. What you need to know. Clermont Ferrand boasts the world's first international short film festival, which is started in 1979. The festival is held annually in early February. Check their website for details. Submission deadlines are in either early July or early October, depending on the year of shooting. Why should I submit though? Prestige, exposure, and opportunity. This 10-day event hosts over 100,000 attendees annually. So if you are accepted, there's a good chance that you will get at least some of the right eyeballs on your film. Winners of the festival's top prize, the Grand Prix, can expect an award of 4,000 euros, which is between four and $5,000 US. Not too shabby. Nugget three. Got an animated film? Then you need to make sure you check out Encounters Short Film and Animation Festival. The longest running short film and animation festival in England. It's the umbrella festival for the two competition strands, Animated Encounters and Brief Encounters. Particularly, animated short film producers might want to check this festival out. All films must be available in 35 millimeter, millimeter? All films must be available in 35 millimeter print or DCP file for screening at the festival. You must submit through realport.com. When? The festival date is annually in mid-September, but check the website for the exact dates. Each year, the Encounters Festival Grand Prix winners qualify for consideration in the short films category of the annual Academy Awards. One fest that is known for celebrating and supporting the new and upcoming filmmakers is the Aspen Shorts Fest. Shorts, shorts, shorts fest, short, short, shorts fest. The festival embraces shorts filmmakers and the potential of the forum to help find the next generation of great filmmakers. It is widely renowned as one of the world's leading showcases for international and U.S. shorts, a status underscored by their Oscar qualifying international competition. The festival takes place in April, most deadlines go to about November of the previous year. Check the website to be sure of the dates for this year. Why should I submit though? Cash prizes. Aspen Shorts Fest mission is to create an intimate international forum to support and honor filmmakers who make shorts. And they put their money where their mouth is by offering cold, hard cash. The centerpiece of the festival is its widely respected international competition in which approximately 80 selected finalists in several categories compete for various cash prizes from $500 to $2,500 US. Certain winners may also qualify for Academy Award consideration. If you are based in the East, then you need to look at the Short Shorts Film Festival and Asia. Since 2004, the festival has been officially recognized as the only Academy accredited short film festival in Japan. <sighs> Early to mid June annually. Submit though. Cash and Cache. 
The short shorts competition attracts more than 3,000 submissions from all over the world, meaning it carries a lot of prestige for filmmakers looking to get worldwide exposure and to beef up their bona fides. Bona fides. Bona fides? Bona fides. Bona fides. Sounds like it's Spanish. Winners of the best short award receive 600,000 yen. Bam! 600 times. Finally, the Grand Prix Award winner is eligible for an Academy Award nomination in the short film categories the following year. Thanks for watching. Check you next time. That's it. But particularly, that's a hard word, particularly, particularly, partic this, this thing, I don't think this thing is on, man. Is this on? Akamatsu Creative.